Hey guys, so I wanted to update you on Spice. I am so glad to hear that she's well and doing well. Um, she did explain, like I hope that she would, on her social media handle, that she um, had some issues. It's not exactly what people thought that it was in regards to the BBL situation. Um, it's still unclear if, uh, she even got a BBL, maybe later on down the line, she will, you know, maybe explain further. If not, she has every right not to, that is her business. Um, she didn't even have to do an update. She has been off of Instagram from what I could see over a month. And she made a post, uh, sometime in October, about three weeks ago, I'll say, and, you know, basically she was off this, you know, all the clickbait and harassment, you know, all of the glory and the hard work that she has put into her craft. She was basically taking a break from social media. So she says, thank you, Jesus, for saving my life. Hey, besties, I'm in a better space today to properly update you on my current health situation. I, su I suffered a damaged hernia a few days ago that sent my body into septus. As a result, I was rushed to the hospital for immediate surgery. As you know, I've been off social media for a while to rest mentally. So little did I know that during my medical scare, it was already been said that I had a heart attack. I was in a coma, it says, and I also died. Um, but none of this is true. However, I'm still recovering from what really happened. So thanks so much for all the prayers and concerns. Please take great care of yourself. Eat, live, love, laugh. It says, like, it's your last day. I love you all so, so much. It says, and uh, done. No, Gracie always, it says, always a go be herself. So I guess this is no more jumping off a speaker box for me to all the uh, promoters that has confirmed booking with me. Please accept my humble apology. It says, K man, I know you was up next for the 20th of this month. However, I'll see you at a later date. Any further information needed. There's always a contact in the bio. The queen loves you all. So let me just say this. Cause I know people are going to still run with the narrative. Um, you know, if she did get a BBL and that is exactly what caused all this, that is that woman's business. Now I've just recently started doing commentary on the effects and how dangerous it is with this procedure BBL. And I'm going to start doing other cosmetic surgery uh, videos. Anything in regards to health and wellness will be on my channel going forth. However, I'm not a judgmental person. I just want to spread awareness that BBLs are the dangerous and highly risked surgeries or complications that you can endure getting this procedure done. You can either have, you know, fatal death situations. You just got to be careful getting these procedures done, any cosmetic procedures done. Um, but I think that in all fairness, we have to go with what Spice said that medically is wrong with her. She does not have to be transparent when it comes to her health, because honestly, that is a sensitive topic and should be shared if, uh, one wants to share that with the public. Other than that, I think the only service that she owes to the public is her talent. Um, so for her to even take the time out of her day while she's trying to recover from a health scare, I really, uh, you know, commend her and respect that she even reached out. Where this information came from about a second BBL and uh, there being an issue, we will probably never know. Um, I'm quite sure the first one that she got, she shared that with you know, her supporters. And sometimes that's not always a good thing when we share a lot of our personal behind the scenes type of situations with the public, because when you put people in your business, they stay in your business. And that seems to be the case here. People are making false allegations about something 
that they were not physically in the flesh to even speak on. I just want to say, you know, I'm going to update you guys um, if she does another update in regards to people still trying to, you know, run this narrative that it was her having a heart attack because of the complications from a BBL. I'm going to update you guys what is going on, um, how she's taking uh, all the information that she's going to obviously um, find out about through, you know, YouTube, Instagram, Twitter. Um, and again, I know she's trying to get herself well. I hope she doesn't stress herself out over something she has no control over. People are going to talk whether you do good or bad. And she, I'm quite sure, is well aware that that's, that's why she had took off almost a month from social media because sometimes we have to do it for our own mental clarity and sanity get away from people who are going to trigger you um even when there's no reason to trigger somebody especially when you see somebody on top of their game a lot of reasons why people troll and triggers because of the the hate that they have in their heart um and not wanting to appreciate somebody's success but again i'm so glad that she's doing well and you know i'm quite sure this is an updated picture of her she looks uh like she's doing well um in my opinion you know i hope she's getting a lot of rest you know like i said you know because people have already planted that seed that something more terrible happened to her uh in regards to her getting a procedure bbl you know people are gonna run with this for quite some time because that's what people do this is social media uh, but on the other side of the fence, playing devil's advocate, maybe that in fact did happen. But you know what? She does have the right, whether it happened or not, the way people are telling the story. That is ultimately, at the end of the day, Spice's business. Um, any complications that she has now or going further in her life from the decision she makes, she has to live with that. And we are not the ones that can, you know, judge that. We just have to hope that whatever anyone does in life, that they're safe, they're uh, prosperous in whatever that, that, that they do, and that they don't put their health at risk um, and possible death. So, you know, all my prayers go out to Spice. I'm glad, again, that she was physically able to... Um, reach out to her supporters and let everybody know that she's alive and well and that she'll be back on the set after she rests her body and does what she needs to do in order to be you know the spice that we all know